Today is week nine, day two. And our reading strategy is compare and contrast. Compare and contrast means to think about the similarities and differences. And in this page, we're going to do between mice and rats. As you read, draw a plus sign next to each detail that tells how the animals are alike. Draw a minus sign next to each detail that tells how the animals are different. So let's do one together. People use the words mouse and rat when talking about small furry animals with big ears and pointy noses and a long tail. So we could say that that's a plus because they are small furry animals that look like this. However, there are many kinds of rats and mice, such as Norway rats, black rat, house mouse, and deer mouse. The most common rat that people usually see is the Norway rat. The most common rat that people usually see is the Norway rat, while the house rat is the most common mouse that people find in their homes. So here are gonna come some differences. So you could say that there are many different kinds of both. That could be a plus, a way that they're similar. And then here it says, if the differences confuse you, you're not alone. So now we're gonna hear some differences. So you'll put minuses there. All right, you can finish doing that together or yourselves and then answer the questions.